Okay, welcome back. I need a pickaxe. Do I still? Okay. <laughs> and yeah. Okay. Now I can go back and do what I was going to do in the previous video. I swear, someone's going to. Someone who's good at the video editing software is going to find this video and then. They'll have a compilation of times that I've gotten lost in the same section. I can just see it popping up with a little counter. Ding! This is how many times Mondevu got lost. Ah, here we go. I'm starting to learn that when I reach that four-way point, I turn and look around. Oh, my wrist. It's not even the mouse wrist. That's what sucks. That's not the part that's supposed to hurt. Oh, well. Okay. Dungeon where the two skeletons were fighting. They have despawned at this point. And this is actually the end of the mine <laughs> in this direction. Everything else looks like it's a cave. So I'll go ahead and take these parts up. And light some things up. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, that's a cave. Okay, well, I want to go ahead and light it up enough that nothing spawns close. Oh, here we go. Here's a chance to show y'all what uh, what the lapis looks like before you mine it, and it gives it gives you a good bit. I'm just being nosy. What the what the? Why did I get stuck? Oh, hello, ravine. Oh my goodness. Okay, lighting this up. I already have ravineception going on back there. I wonder if that one connects to the other somehow. But yeah, let's go ahead and light up sections where things could spawn and surprise me like that freaking creeper. There we go. Okay. okay. Oops, wrong side. <laughs> and I think that's it on this side. We just have to go back to the other invisible staircase and find out what's down there. And why did I do that? No, wait. Wrong one. And then from there, we can probably find the end of the mine. Now, I'm probably not necessarily going to ignore the ravine, even though I've been through a few already, but... Um, and there goes my train of thought. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, okay. I. But yeah, I'm probably not going to ignore that ravine just in case I run out of places to mine in the other ravines. Because on occasion that does happen. Okay, now I get to figure out how. To hey, there's more of a mine down there! Um. Um. Well, okay, first. Uh, I guess I'm going to have to dig my way down first. Oh, that's right! I forgot! I have like a wall of gravel to go back and explore somewhere. I just don't remember where it is. I think it's still in that first bit. But I'm going to fix this bit first. Start by lighting things up. Was that a... No, that was water. Still! Even so... See, this is what I meant earlier about finding gaps in the mines that are open. <laughs> yeah, see? That could have been really bad. No, I refuse. I refuse. I am not letting you up here. The answer is no. No. <laughs> Just no. There is no getting up here without my say-so. Of course, what do I do? I go down here to where he can potentially get me. But I, want, I don't want things to spawn in places where they can get to me. So, I'm going to do myself a favor and light some stuff up. <laughs> light up all the things. There we go. Okay. Um... Have I been here? Oh my gosh! I have been here. Like, more so than I thought. <laughs> I never explored this path either. 
Okay. Oh, down we go. Like I said, this, sec this section is just going to be subtitled Mondevu Gets Lost. I'm actually running out of enough wood to do repairs, so I'm going to start ignoring the wood. Because even though I can just hack more of it, I want to be able to make more torches. So I will worry less about the wood and more about the aesthetics of the rest of the stuff, like getting rid of cobwebs and random bits of stone sticking out. There we go. Okay. That was easy. Okay. Uh, where was the chunk that I... Oh, I remember this part. Did I ever actually explore it? Not all of it. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going this way then. Um, I don't like that. I somehow managed to lose where I originally came from. I'm not quite sure how that happened. No! How many arrows do I have? You will not ninja me. Eat it. I aimed right for your mouth. You eat that thing. Boop. And... I'm really good at finding bats. Okay, so there's the staircase. I know there's like a torch on this side somewhere. I can tell because of the lighting. But still. Bright lights are good in Minecraft. They keep monsters away. Or at least prevent them from appearing. Oh, that must have been where you came from. This is all kinds of twisting and turning and getting lost. I see you, creeper. Probably can't see him very well in the video, but there is a creeper down there. <laughs> what if I can hit him from here? Eh. No. Well, maybe. It doesn't matter anyway, I'm out of arrows. I'd have to fight a skeleton. Which means I need to fight the creeper the old-fashioned way. Provided he'll come out of that box. Eh. I want my arrow back. Okay, that's good. <sighs> wow. This mine expanded quickly. That bat looks like he's laughing at me. He's like, you almost got blown up. <laughs> I know my way around and you don't, either. That's okay, I'm learning. I'm learning, slowly but surely. Hi, Creeper. Alright, so... Um, clean up a little bit of this, and then, uh, I will see you people at the next video. Whoops, helps if I use the correct tool. Alrighty.